we do get ready for that cold, experts want to make sure that you are ready. Absolutely. You know, most fires are started by heaters that folks have in their home. News Force Hunter Elise is here to tell us about National Fire Protection Association's warning for all of us as the weather gets colder this weekend, Hunter. Yeah, Kevin and Jolene, when that air gets cold, you know, the heat turns on, but the Oklahoma City Fire Department says it can turn deadly if you're not properly prepared. Be sure and change out your filters. I mean, they collect dust throughout the year. That dust can then catch on fire and you can have a little electrical issue. The National Fire Protection Association says between 2016 and 2020, 13% of house fires were due to heating equipment. Of those, most involve space heaters. And when it comes to space heaters, there's a simple rule that says space heaters need space. Chenoweth says a good rule of thumb is keeping a three-foot distance from space heaters and keeping the area around them clear. Also adding that they should be plugged in directly to an outlet and turned off when sleeping or leaving the house. They can catch curtains on fire, they can catch the couch on fire, any towels or clothes you may have. If you use a fireplace, make sure, especially if it's wood burning, make sure it's been serviced recently. If you aren't using a space heater or fireplace, but still want to keep heat inside the home, og and &E says you can open curtains on south side windows during the day to let sunlight in. Check windows and doors for air leaks and apply weather stripping if needed. And make sure baseboard heaters aren't blocked by furniture or rugs. And if you do need a place to get warm, there are some warming stations um, around the state. You can go to our website, kfor.com.